Okay, hello everyone, Clark Towson here. I'm the CEO of INTJ Billing. This video today, I'd like to talk about a graphic uh, on screen now. This is from the Invest Answers YouTube channel. And uh, what James has done here, he's uh, created uh, this graphic and this, uh, this table uh, with the Bitcoin halvings. Okay, first halving up to the sixth halving. You can see the years between 2012 up to 2032. And he's made some price predictions, some conservative price predictions of the price of Bitcoin um, you know, going forward. You can see the fourth halving, which is in about 500 days from now. In 2024, he's projected the price of 81858 US dollars, um, which is around... Uh, 2.8 million Thai baht. Uh, on screen now, the uh, the figures in Thai baht. Very interesting chart. Very uh, conservative projections, I think, as to where the price of Bitcoin will be uh, in the future. Of course, um, you know it's a, it's a prediction, and uh, making predictions within the Bitcoin space can lead you to getting egg on your face because the price of Bitcoin is so volatile, but still um, very interesting to uh, to look at those projections. Now, what I want to talk about in this video, though, is uh, you know the setting up of uh, Bitcoin hot wallets for the Thai bar girls uh, in Soy Six uh, on their mobile phones and taking custody of their private keys um, gives them the opportunity to accumulate Bitcoin over time and to use Bitcoin as their personal savings vehicle in a safe and secure manner. Of course, the, um, their private keys will be kept by INTJ Billing in a secure vault at Siam Secure. Now, in addition to this, of course, uh, I'm pioneering uh, the, uh, the hot wallets uh, for them on INTJ Billing's uh, infrastructure. Now, I won't be encouraging the bar girls to, um, to leave any Bitcoin on, on my server, uh, on my exchange, right? But we'll be instead paying that Bitcoin out to them in Thai bar um, ASAP. And this, of course, uh, eliminates uh, or greatly reduces the risk of being hacked in order um, you know, for the hackers to get at a honeypot of Bitcoin that's kept on uh, online. So I think um, doing things in, in this way, uh, this is the way to go. Both the, you know, giving the, the Thai bar girls the ability to have their, their own Bitcoin wallet on their phone, which I've uh, got their keys in, in safe storage for, so they'll never lose that Bitcoin. Um, being able to use their wallets uh, in that manner to accumulate Bitcoin over time, and being able to use their hot wallet on my infrastructure so that they can receive Bitcoin payments quickly uh, for instant conversion into, or very fast conversion into Thai bar. So we have these two important services, uh, which I'm pioneering over here in Soy6 Pattaya, that will over time uh, result in the bar girls that I work with receiving Bitcoin for that fast exchange and, and payment in Thai bar. Um, and receiving Bitcoin for the purpose of holding not onto it as a long-term store of value. Now, both of these services uh, are important, and Soy6 needs both of these services. Now, having me uh, or you know, my company, INTJ Billing, having me or, or my representative available on the ground within the Soy6 environment gives the bar girls the opportunity to cash out of their Bitcoin holdings uh, at a convenient, um, yeah, in a convenient location and at a time that's convenient for them as well. Now, thinking about the price in uh, of Bitcoin in 2024 at the next halving, so we're currently 497 days away from the next block reward halving event. And uh, as I said, uh, Invest Answers has forecast a Bitcoin value of 81,858 US dollars or 2.845 million Thai baht. Now, this, of course, is a life changing amount of money for a Thai bar girl, right? 
Now in 2028 and 2032, you see even higher figures for the price of Bitcoin at 15 million and 30 million Thai bar. So we're talking about life-changing uh, amounts. If the bar girls are able to um, you know, receive Bitcoin for their services and if they hold on to it and accumulate, accumulate it over time, um, they can make life-changing uh, amounts of wealth, right? You know, this service that I'm pioneering, if I wasn't over here pioneering it and doing this kind of work, then they wouldn't have the opportunity to, to do that, right? So it's interesting to think of it like that. Now, at the time of making this video, it's Wednesday, the 21st of December, 2022. Um, it's interesting to look out 10 years and to think about where the price of Bitcoin might be by then, whilst also thinking about the current day uh, price and the innovation that's occurring uh, within the, in the Bitcoin industry. Now, my company, INTJ Billing, sees great opportunity in helping the Thai bar girls uh, with Bitcoin. Me coming over here to Pattaya and working with the bar girls, even if they don't recognize the opportunity with Bitcoin and what it can do for them, I recognize the opportunity. Right? And those of you who are watching my videos, uh, you re recognize the opportunity as well. Right? Now, part of my work uh, I see is trying to help educate the bar girls about Bitcoin, right? And about how Bitcoin can help them, what Bitcoin can do for them, essentially. Now, some might say, Clark, you're nuts. Uh, the bar girls are never going to understand something as complex as Bitcoin. Yet I see the same bar girls, right, using the internet on their mobile phones. And I think to myself, well, they're able to do that. They're able to use the internet. But they don't have a clue as to how TCP IP works. Right? And of course, they don't need to understand TCP IP and how it works in order to use the internet. Um, and so it goes with the services that I'm pioneering over here. The bar girls don't need to understand how Bitcoin works in order to benefit from it. They just need to be able to listen and follow my directions. Now, some of you might say, well, Clark, they're not even going to do that. All right. So you're going to have a challenge with that as well. I know, I know, um, but I think I've got those things covered. I think that I, I will be able to do those things, right? Um, I'll be able to offer direction. And uh, you know, an expat over here has given me some advice and uh, I send him messages on, on his, uh, send him messages to his phone whenever something comes up and he's been right about, right about something, right? So, um, yeah, some of his advice was, well, look, you know, that they're hard work. Um, dealing with them is hard work. And sometimes you can say something to them and um, you think that they've understood it. And they'll say, yes, 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 they understand. But what they really meant was, no, they don't understand, right? So this is the sort of stuff that, I, that, that I'm dealing with. But that's okay. It just means that um, I have to handle all that complexity and explain things and demonstrate things in such a way that it's so simple that they can understand it. So that's a challenge to me because I'm used to working with PhDs, right? I'm not used to working with street level people, but I can adapt my approach, all right? So over here in Pattaya, I'm currently, if you think about a pond, I'm creating ripples at the moment in the pond small but important ripples uh, that will lead to waves over time. Ripples of positive change that will over time help change the lives of the people that I work with, right? Now it's early days, yes, but I'm over here doing this. Right? And that ripple effect, one small change that could have enormous impact over time. If you think about the two changes I'm talking about, the setup of the Bitcoin hot wallets for each bar girl on INTJ Billings infrastructure, plus the setup of their own hot wallet on their mobile phone. Those are two really, really powerful and important changes, right? Having INTJ Billing or my representative in Soy6 being able to handle the conversion of Bitcoin into Thai Bart, um, that's another really important um, function. But if you think about all this together, uh, they're very, very important changes, right? 
Now, if you look at the current price of Bitcoin, very few, if any, sex workers in Soyuz 6, other than those I have directly worked with, have got Bitcoin wallets set up. Okay? Now, we've got a, a time frame, current price of Bitcoin, we've got a time frame before the next block reward halving is approximately um, 500 days. Now, if I can set up the hot wallets for uh, hundreds of bar girls in Soyuz 6 over the next 500 days, that's a big ripple effect, right? Now, the bar girls, having been exposed to Bitcoin because of my work, will then start looking at the price of Bitcoin and will see it rising and want a piece of the action. Now, this got me to thinking because um, I, I've been thinking about this for a while. I want to put up a sign in Soy 6, a big Bitcoin sign. Um, and I've been thinking about what that sign will look like. Will it just be a Bitcoin sign? Will it be illuminated? Will it have my uh, INTJ Billings logo next to it? Um, how will it look? And I hit upon the, the, the idea um, just a couple of minutes ago. I thought, what I really need to do, put up a big Bitcoin and INTJ billing illuminated sign, yes. But underneath the sign, what I'm going to do, I'm going to have the current price of Bitcoin, right? Now, if there's a big Bitcoin sign, INTJ billing sign, and the current price of Bitcoin in Thai baht in Soy 6, Every one of those sex workers, right, who works in Soy 6 will look up and they will have seen the sign and they will see that the price is always changing. And that will get them to thinking, oh, what is this Bitcoin? What is INTJ billing, right? Oh, Bitcoin price is high. I really think it's a great idea. And um, I've made some inquiries um, with a sign company over here in Pattaya um, to, uh, to get this sign made up. So... I'm going to contact another couple of companies as well uh, for quotes. But I really think that in Soy 6, if there's a big Bitcoin sign and it's illuminated and it's got the current price of Bitcoin on there, I think that's a, a really, a really excellent idea, right? Bar girls see it, come to INTJ billing, set up their Bitcoin wallets, buy infrastructure, and on their, their phone, I'm operating as an exchange, right? I just, we can just see it all, all working very, very well. Anyway, that's, uh, that's it for this video. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. All the best, everyone. I'm Clark Towson, CEO of INTJ Bill.